Yum. Peppers, onions, and garlic. Okay, onions cooked. Let's turn that to low because I have a wicked sweet tooth and I really like to let these onions caramelize. To the sacrifice of a few peppers and maybe some burnt onions, but I like mine really cooked. Put that on low for a few more. Burger. Processed duck egg. Oh. Okay, we're going to take our peppers and onions, which look yummy. Good, look at how clear they are. Yum. Okay, so we're going to take our half of egg. There's a little more than half. I'm going to put some in the pan and cook it for the dog while our peppers and onions cool off. So, because my duck eggs are twice that of a chicken egg, I find that I have enough to make some for the dog or the cat or something extra for my ducks. So, I only need to use part of the egg for the burger along with, I would say, a tablespoon of rosemary and probably a couple teaspoons of thyme. I know I'm liberal with my spices. <laughs> um, and black pepper. I don't know, probably 20 twists on the grinder. Maybe 15. It felt like 20. <laughs> so I'll just mix that up and we're going to roll it out on the on the um, parchment paper, which I already started to do, but I forgot to put all the stuff in. So, here we go. So, between two parchment papers, I rolled out the meat. I used American cheese because this is a family meal, and that's what my son says. <laughs> I'd prefer sharp or even provolone, but this is what we like. And um, I put the vegetables on, and because I need a anti-inflammatory diet, let's see, I put tons of turmeric. Turmeric. And we're gonna roll this up. So here we are, all wrapped up. Work with the paper. Don't do all the rolling by yourself, and don't make the paper do all the rolling by yourself. That's my suggestion. You do a little and the paper does a little, it works out. And we're going to put this in the oven. You could put a sauce on it. I'm going to do mine plain. A tomato sauce, I guess a white sauce. I don't know. I'm just going to do mine plain and I'm going to cook it above the juices. Because I think there's going to be a lot of juices. <laughs> Here it goes. 350 and I'll probably check it in a half an hour. Okay, this is 40 minutes, looking great. I think it's done. Okay, first, I cut here, and as I couldn't see much, I cut this way. And that told me, yes, we've done. All the way through, meat's cooked. Yum. But 